I just woke up, as you saw in my little montage, and um, I'm just gonna show you what I do on a Sunday to reset for the week. Today, basically, we're just gonna clean, edit, and just get everything done that I need to get done on a Sunday. So I was checking my emails because last night at like four in the morning, I sent an email to my teacher because she had the wrong chapters listed for us to read this week. So I wanted to like clarify, make sure I'm reading the right stuff before I have to like read extra because that's not happening. So I sent her that and I scheduled it. I didn't just send it at four in the morning. I would never do that. But I scheduled it to send at like 11 this morning and I thought she was gonna respond because she normally responds quickly but she didn't respond I think the reason why though is because we have our fall break tomorrow in Tuesday she's probably like not checking her emails which is fine but I kind of wanted to get it done before the like during the fall break because I just want to be done with the class we're so close today we have to edit a video that's going up on Tuesday it is a mukbang which I honestly haven't done in so long it was my my last mukbang was my first ever video of two months ago it just made two months so I want to do another one and they came out with the adult kids meals from McDonald's so obviously I had to go try those and I need to edit it it's not going to be that bad of editing because mukbangs are so easy to edit and I always wash clothes on Sundays. I always, I always do laundry. I love doing laundry. And then I need to do the dishes. And there was something else I needed to do too, but I don't even remember what it was. I don't feel that good, but I'm eating. They're like chocolate covered almonds from almonds, almonds, I don't know, from Bucky's. And they're so good. Like these are my new favorite chocolate covered almonds. I feel like this isn't really a Sunday thing. It's more like an everyday thing, but I always like to refill the refrigerator, like the waters. Okay, I changed my shirt because it's laundry day and like I don't have shirts. So I'm gonna wash this one that I was just wearing. And so we're gonna start the laundry now. I normally do a dark load, a light load, and then I do my sister's clothes too. Now while I wait for my laundry to be done, I'm going to begin editing the video. I kind of like do editing in increments because if I just sit down and edit a video, I will get bored with it and like it won't be as good as if I took a break from it and then came back to it. And so normally I do it for two days. Like I finish it in one night and then I'll come back the second day and add or edit things and delete things that I don't really like. I actually also just realized that I really have been needing to clean my room and like I'm not a dirty room person but I clean mine up like consistently like if I pull out a bunch of clothes and I'm getting ready I'll put them all back by the end of the night but I just have like cords out and my hard drive and stuff like I just keep pulling out memory cards and I just leave them out and like I pulled out a chapstick and it's just being like left out I know it sounds like really stupid but I'm kind of a I'm not a clean freak but I really like cleaning and like I enjoy it it's like therapeutic to me so if I ever make a mess I just like clean it up immediately I also just ordered a new tripod so like I have I, like tried it out and then I just like put it on my desk so I really need to find a spot for it to keep it and it's just like miscellaneous stuff and I have all these like school notes out on here on like my pencil pouch I just need to like put that all in my school bag but I do have a final exam so I don't want to like put it all the way yet because like I'm literally almost done in a few days I really want to also wash my comforter and my sheets because I haven't done that in like three weeks and I've been trying to do every other week but I need to do that because I skipped like for the past two weeks I just had to change into biker shorts because um, I needed to wash my other shorts. Like I hate laundry day because then I end up wearing stuff that like I wouldn't normally wear because I just have like nothing else, you know? But now I'm editing, still editing. My second load of laundry is done. <laughs> These are reflecting. Hello there. It's about a week later than when I filmed all that other stuff from my Sunday reset. That was a really bad day. I had a really bad like mental breakdown and I was just kind of done. 
and I had a lot going on. I had like my finals coming up and just a lot of like personal issues were going on. So I didn't feel like finishing the video. So <laughs> I really couldn't do it. I was going to finish it, but I just really wasn't up to it. So it's one week later and I decided that I'm going to finish this video. I'm going to try to make it as interesting as possible. I don't even remember what footage I have from last week, but I'm going to piece it together and just kind of show you that not every Sunday is perfect. I get Sunday scaries, I think that's what they call them. I get those all the time and I always just get so overwhelmed with what the week has ahead and I start like overthinking and every single day I need to like get something done and get something done and it always gets done without the stress so i really should just stop stressing and it'll still get done but i can't wrap that around my head we're gonna get some little things done today i need to send an email i need to wash my sheets i've been saying that i need to wash my sheets for the past like two weeks i washed my blankets a few days ago but i need to wash my comforter and my sheets and then i need to clean up around my room and that's it so yeah let's finish this sunday reset so I've mentioned this before, I don't know what video when I mentioned it, but I take quarterly college classes, which means that my classes only last nine weeks. So I'm taking four classes a semester, but they're, they're separated by nine week like intervals. My last two classes just ended. I start two new classes next week. And I feel like they're gonna be a little bit more difficult than the last one, so I just need to make sure everything's prepared and I like get rid of all my other notes from my other classes and just get ready for the two new ones. Yeah, so I'm gonna start by throwing some stuff in the washer. Um, my camera just fell and I almost like broke it in half. Thank God that didn't happen because this is a very expensive camera. As I was saying, I'm normally really good about washing my pillowcase because like acne and stuff like that. So I try to wash it every week or every other week at least. And, but I haven't. So I need to kind of get back on that grind again because it's just the best thing to do. The light in my laundry room is like freaking flickering. So sorry about that. This morning I woke up and it was cold. Like, we're getting colder temperatures, guys. I love the cold. It makes me so happy. And it's been hot for so long. So I woke up this morning and it was in the 60s. So, I mean, I put a sweatshirt on because I was that excited. Because I just want to always wear my sweatshirts and my leggings. And I never can because it's so hot. <laughs> Just started that in the washer, and now we have to wait an hour. In the meantime, I'm gonna like clean up my room and my bed. gonna windex my mirrors in my room and then after I'm going to go do the dishes because I saw that there was kind of a lot and I do the dishes to help out my mom like every two three days I kind of I don't want to like wash the dishes every day because the water bill would be through the roof but I do it when I can to help <laughs> forgot that I posted a video today so if you're watching this go check that out I did like claw clip inspo it's a, such a fun video so you should definitely go check it out and give it a like I kind of found like a new appreciation for dishwashing like this past summer I used to just like dread doing it because people would make me do it, but if I do it on my own, then I really enjoy it. Like if I'm the one who says, hey, I will do the dishes, and I go and do the dishes, it's really enjoyable. This isn't that many dishes at all. Like I've had to do dishes, and I've had like an hour 
worth of stitches to do. That kind of gets aggravating, I'm not gonna lie. But when it's a little amount and it's fun, it's just not that bad. Okay, the one part that I don't like about dishwashing is like if you make food, like for instance, macaroni, and you make it in a bowl, in, in a in a pot, and then like I need to wash the pot, and like the serving spoon is like still has noodles on it. Ugh. That's disgusting to me. And that's the end of the dishes. Now I'm just gonna dust like my room. I try to dust sometimes, but there's just like stuff that gets behind my little decor, just like hair, just piles up. And then like if you forget about it when you're vacuuming, which is really easy to, then it just kind of sits there. So I'm gonna try to get all that out. Everything looks so clean and nice. I finally dusted everything. And I need to write an email for school. I just have to write it, but I've been putting it off. So if I'm getting things done, I might as well do that too. So I just wrote a little bit. And I was checking my grades too at the same time. I have one more assignment due, but it's basically done. So. First two college classes are down. They actually went really well. Like I was so worried about them, but they went really good. I was taking a Christian origins class and a videography class and both of them went really well. But this was a good intro to online college and just letting me get the feel for it and see if I really wanted to do it. And so far I don't regret my decision still and my first classes are done. I do get stressed out still. I, if I'm not stressed, I like to make myself stressed and I just give myself more things to do because if I have free time, I just feel like I'm not doing enough. So I'm just like constantly finding things that I need to improve on and just trying to do them. So my new obsession recently has been boiled eggs. I used to eat them when I was little and then I over, like ate them too many times and then I got grossed out with them but I've been making them in this little like container thing that I go oh look it's right here it's from Amazon like you just like throw them in and then you just hit this button and then they ding 15 minutes later and boom you have boiled eggs and they're they're much better than when you boil them in the pot with hot water just so much better let me tell you my story about last night so I finished my classes, right? So I need to return my textbooks. And I rented them from Netbooks. So I, I just rented them because I don't want to buy a textbook because I don't want to be stuck with it. So anywho, it's time to return the textbook. And I wrote in them because how else can you memorize and know content besides annotating in a book? So I wrote in sticky notes and sometimes I just use pencil and I wrote in the margins. When I went and looked at Netbooks policy, they said that you can't write in more than a third of the book or else they'll charge you the full price of the book so that wasn't happening so i was scared they said you can highlight but i wrote in pencil i didn't think that was that big of a deal last night at like 1 a.m i started erasing and like i had a lot of stuff written in there there was like 20 chapters of content i got a wrist cramp for the first time in my life and it was excruciatingly painful but now I need to bring those back tomorrow and like package them. Belle's being such a good girl, so we should give her a treat. Want a treat? No treat? There you go. Good girl. So that is basically what I do on a Sunday 
to reset for the week and kind of recharge and get ready for what I have to do in the week ahead. Thank you guys so, so, so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. If you're new to my channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button and stick around for all of my fun videos. I will see you guys next time. Bye. I am normally so good about what. Ugh. Thank you.